What is good, you too? It's AJ Boogie. I'm back at it again, and I'm bringing that NBA award hate. I just don't understand the NBA. Their media, their criteria, whoever they pick to make these awards happen, they are absolute garbage. They make no sense and follow no structure. And this goes for every single award almost. Let's start with MVP. James Harden won MVP. Should have been LeBron James. Let me read you these stats. LeBron, more points. LeBron, more rebounds. LeBron, more assists. LeBron, higher field goal percentage. LeBron, higher field goal percentage from three. LeBron, more minutes. LeBron, every single game played to James Harden, 71. LeBron, triple doubles. So who's more valuable? Now let me ask you this. Take LeBron off the Cavs. Take Harden off the Rockets. Who's got a better team? Who's the Cavs second best player? An inconsistent Kevin Love? Who's the Rockets second best player? Hall of Fame Chris Paul. You take LeBron off the Cavs. Cavs are a lottery team. You take James Harden off the Rockets. The Rockets might make the playoffs. Who's more valuable? We all know the answer to that question. I just don't think the NBA media doesn't. It's voters fatigue. LeBron should be the MVP almost every dang year, but the media won't do it. They're tired of giving him the award, and that's a disgrace. Get out of the game. Quit giving these guys votes. They're destroying this. Let's talk rookie of the year. Should have been Donovan Mitchell. Why? Because he's an actual true rookie. Media gives it to their darling, Ben Simmons. Let me remind you, Ben Simmons' true rookie year broke his foot. A four to six week injury rehab process sat out the whole year. So he was healthy to play. So Ben Simmons gets to practice for a whole year with his teammates. So he's got a chemistry with them. Donovan Mitchell didn't. Ben Simmons could practice whenever he wanted to. He could lift weights whenever he wanted to. He could train for however long he wanted to. Donovan Mitchell couldn't. Ben Simmons plays with an all-star in Joel Embiid. Who does Donovan Mitchell play with? Who's in the East? Who made the playoffs in the West? So, another butchered award. Now here's the problem. You won't give LeBron the MVP award because he has better stats. You give it to James Harden because his team won more. Okay. The Sixers won one more game than the Jazz. The Sixers were 52 and 30, Jazz 51 and 31. Ben Simmons plays cupcakes in the East, and rookie Donovan Mitchell plays all the top dogs in the West. That should have been your tiebreaker. Besides, of course, one being an actual rookie and one being a rookie plus one year. So that makes two. NBA butchered that one. Here's what's going to make the case why LeBron should have been MVP. How does Lou Williams win sixth man of the year? If LeBron lost the MVP award because James Harden team won, Lou Williams shouldn't have even been in the discussion. It should have been Eric Gordon's award. Lou Williams averaged 22 points. He played for the Clippers. Who else is going to score? Eric Gordon comes off the bench for the Houston Rockets, the team with the most wins. Doesn't have as good a stats as Lou Williams. So NBA, where do we draw the line? Do we draw the line at his team won more? Or do we draw the line at this guy had better stats? You make no sense. Coach of the year, how are you going to give it to Dwayne Casey and not Mike D'Antoni? Yet again, Dwayne Casey, the media darling. You got Mike D'Antoni over here who has the MVP on his team, leads his team to the best record in the NBA, you don't give him the award. It just makes no sense to me. What is the criteria? Who does the NBA give these votes to in the media? Get them out. Defensive player of the year. They give it to Rudy Gobert instead of Anthony Davis. Rudy Gobert missed 22 games. That's almost 20% of the season. What is your criteria? Who do you let these guys vote? Who are they? My last point I want to make. Don't ever let Travis Scott perform during these awards again. And I like Travis Scott. Here's my proposal. If you're going to give these guys votes again, let the fans decide who wins the awards. You might as well. Because it sounds like to me, whoever these media members are, they're fans. 
they're not sport analysts. They're not basketball analysts. That's all the heat I got for today. Like, comment, subscribe to the Boogie Squad. AJ Boogie, and I'm out. Boom!